up going three and two for the day. Just kind of, uh, I think we're going to be tied for third with uh, FDU, I believe, lost to SFA. So Nebraska and uh, SFA will be tied for first, and we'll be tied for third. But I mean, the, this is basically a kind of like a glorified practice. It's more or less getting information about ball reaction and who's playing well. And you know, the one thing that I would say is, is we still got to get a little bit better. Um, if we can perform a little bit better under pressure and not have as many mistakes as we had. We had a few too many mistakes from time to time, but if we get those corrected, everything will go well tomorrow. I think we did well on staying positive, even though we didn't strike. We hit the pocket a lot. We didn't always strike a lot, but we kept our energy up and our positivity up, so that helped a lot. Today's definitely important for like the freshmen coming in. Um, they know what Nationals is all about now. Get all the nerves out of the way, especially for myself. And see how the like, ball reaction, see how, you know, how we're lining up and everything. I think today's important. Match one, we had a little bit of, we could have won that match, and we kind of gave that one away, and then we, we talked a little bit about, you know, don't lose it, make sure that you compete, you know, and so we competed much better the, last, the next three matches. Match against Sam Houston, I actually didn't think we played horrible. We had a couple of uh, solid eight pins in the pocket. Missed a couple of spares early, um, but I think that uh, we could have won that match if things would have went a little bit differently but um, for that aspect of things I mean I'm being three and two I mean we're sitting okay it's not the end of the world where we're at. I think the biggest thing is is you almost have to look at it like you're just competing against the the lane and the pins. Um, it's almost like when a basketball player goes and shoots a free throw you know you just have to block everything out and you just have to pretend that nothing else exists besides all you can control is making a really good shot off your hand and hitting your spot. So if you try to make the moment bigger than it is, it'll cause you to fail. So if you just stay within actually what it is, and that's you're just throwing a round ball at a spot at 10 pins, if you take that mentality, I think things will go well tomorrow.